Installation instructions for your TORCOM Enterprise IP phone. The following items are included in the standard package. The stand, the IP phone, the handset, Ethernet cable, handset cord, and the power adapter. To assemble the phone, first attach the stand. In this example, we show the desk mount method. If you have purchased a console module, your package will include the stand, connecting sheet, connecting cord, and appropriate screws in addition to the console module. Use the connecting sheet and the spiral shells or screws to connect the console module to the IP phone. Next, attach the stands both to the IP phone and the console module. Next, it's time to connect the network and the power. You have two options for network and power connections. The AC power option and the POE power over Ethernet option. Okay. Now connect the handset cord to the phone port. If you are using the console module, use the connecting cord and connect the XT in port on the module to the EXT port on the IP phone. Now attach the other end of the handset cord to the handset. Now attach the other end of the Ethernet cable to your LAN port and your power plug to the electricity. After the IP phone has been connected to the network and supplied with power, it automatically begins a process of initializing itself on the network. Once that is complete, you can begin to configure the phone, either via the web user interface or the phone user interface. Press the check mark button to get the IP address of your phone. Open the web browser of your computer and enter the IP address into the address bar click enter. Enter the username and password admin and admin in the pop-up dialog and click OK. Access the network tab to configure the network settings. Access the account tab to set parameters for the account. Press Confirm to save the changes. Once you see the registered icon on the LCD screen, implementation is complete and you can start to use the phone.